hello everyone now we will discuss about api in this video so first we'll learn what is api api is the acronym for application programming interface so as name suggests api is a messenger that take request from user and tell the system what you want to do and return the response back to that user okay so in other word we can say api is a software that allow two application to talk with each other so here you can see we have application a and we have application b now application a want to communicate with application b so with the help of this api application a make a request and this api send that request to application b now this api take response from application b and send back to application a so in this way api helping application a and b to communicate with each other in real life example we can say waiter working as a api so when customer comes in a restaurant waiter take request from customer and pass this request to kitchen now he collect all the prepared food as per request and then he send this response back to this customer okay so here you can see this waiter taking request sending to target system that is kitchen taking response from there and sending back to this customer that is sender okay in this way this waiter working as a api now what is web service okay so web service is a piece of code available on internet okay so our api is a web service or not so if our api is hosted on in, uh, internet then our api is also a web service okay now we have two type of web service one is soap web service and another one is rest web service okay so we will discuss one by one about soap web service and rest web service first soap web service first soap is known as a simple object access protocol okay so whenever we will create any web service using this soap protocol then that web service is known as a soap web service again soap web service allow only one message format that is xml message format okay if we are getting request in other another message format then first we need to convert in xml format then only we will able to process that message now soap web service define standard that should be strictly followed okay that's why we create visual file and all we follow all the standard whenever we want to create any soap web service okay now soap web service works on http protocol which is the default protocol used by all web application okay so next soap web service need more bandwidth for its usage compared to rest web service that's why now it is rest web service getting too much popularity compared to soap web service next point soap service has their own security framework that is owsm security framework okay this is the one reason uh, soap web service having some benefit over rest web service since since rest web service there has hasn't any their security framework but soap web service has their own security framework and soap web service cannot make use of rest web service okay now we will talk about rest web service so rest stand for representation state transfer okay and this is not a protocol this is a architecture pattern so if any web service follow this architecture pattern then that service is a rest web service okay now rest web service need less bandwidth as we discuss soap web service take more bandwidth and rest rest web service need less bandwidth that's why rest web web service getting too much popularity nowadays rest web service has one more advantage it support multiple message format in soap web service we have only xml message format but rest web service support multiple message format it can be plain text it can be xml it can be html it can be json okay now rest web service do not have their own security framework it always rely on http security framework but in soap we have owsm security framework but rest web service always rely on 
HTTP security framework and REST service can make use of SOAP web service. So till this point we discuss about what is API, what is web service and we have two type of web service one is SOAP web service and another one is REST web service. In next video we will discuss more about REST web service. Okay, thanks.